the stall next to her. So man throws a cigarette into the toilet. And the whole thing catches on fire. No fucking way. What are you doing in here? Hey, that's my fucking coffee. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Relax, you guys. First of all, this is anything but coffee. And secondly, I'm here because head office hired me to run a pen test on your system. And good job, guys. You passed. Yeah. Hey, Ray. Hey, it's Tobias. Uh, yeah. Everything's solid here. Good. Okay, yeah, I'll tell him. She wants me to check Ray. your routers, too. Ray, Yeah. I was walking outside. Yeah, okay, will do. What? Thanks. Bye now. No, hey, look, me. Pencil pushers. What can you do, huh? Hey. Hey! <laughs> Little will know I'm here. I gotta move. I had high hopes for Bloom when I applied. I fell for the whole damn sales pitch. I knew we'd do something groundbreaking, but this thing was broken from the get-go. Now I'm too late, and the CTOS is too big. If I play it smart, I can trap some of these mouth breathers in their offices. Holy shit, that's Raymond! Five bucks here? for an Holy autograph, shit. asshole! Is there a security convention in town? I've never seen so many guards. What's going on? Here. Raymond Kenny. No fucking way. Here? That's what they're claiming. You know, my dad used to work with a guy who said he was surly, but really just a big hippie once you got to know him. Yeah, well, your dad probably Keep never alert. saw any of the. <laughs> for now, but I'm gonna have to find a vulnerability pronto.
she wrote. Time to bail. Well, shit. All that just for little old me. I'll get set up. Pick him off, no problem. Getting set up. It's over. Sonora, Bloom. It's been real fun. trail into Bloom system. Over the next two weeks, they're gonna see me pop up in Wichita, Amarillo, Tucson. I'll drop off their map somewhere in Mexico. Well, you head in the other direction. Hey, I've got a one-way cruise out of Miami. If things ever calm down, I'll find a way to contact you. But... You take care of yourself, T-Bone. Stay out of trouble this time. Oh, I intend to. Adios, amigo. Adios.
Honey, I'm home. First rule of survival, always use the back door. Or is it, never make a copy of the key. You ain't pretty, you ain't cozy, and you're sure as shit ain't home. But you were there for me when I needed you, baby. Need to wake up my guard dogs. The escalator is still passing you by. Guess what? You would be more efficient just standing still. <laughs> I gotta burn these hard drives in the morning. I never got to use these. I guess it's better to be an unfulfilled paranoid than a dead one. Last night in the rabbit hole. Oh, I should get some shut eye. Answering you. No, just fuck off. Go away. All right. All right. It's been ten years, Frewer. This had better be good. Ray, send the police. No, wait. Don't send the police. They may be in on it. Can you find me? Calm down. This is another one of your episodes. My episodes? Ray, they're gonna kill me. Do you understand? They who? I don't know. They. They hit me with something. I, I must have blacked out. I... I think maybe I'm in a trunk. I'm definitely in a trunk, Ray. Can you track me? Not very well. Your GPS signal's cutting in and out. Oh, of course. Oh, they're jamming it. Oh, this is bad. Like, fixer bad. Fuck. All right, I'm on my way. Sounds like Frewer is in real danger here. But if I'm gonna get out of Chicago, it needs to be now. Fuck. I can't just leave him. Ray, my phone battery is running low here. I gotta hurry. Calm the fuck down. Now, feel around the latch for a trunk release. If it's a newer car, it'll have one. Uh, nope, nothing. All right, so we know we're in an old car. It's a start. Old car? No, that is not a start. Maybe they removed the trunk latch. You got any tools back there with you? Check for a compartment. There might be a jack in it. Yeah. Yeah, there's a jack. I think I can pop the lid with one of these. That's the idea, but we don't want them to hear it pop.
So I want you to bang around a lot when you do it, and shout, too. Hmm? Okay, here it goes. Hey! Hey, let me out of here! Help! Help! It's open. It worked. Just crack the lid. Tell me what you see. I see construction workers on the road. This is Chicago. That could be anywhere. Oh, road cones. I see a lot of road cones. Road cone? Road cone? Buildings for businesses. What do you say? Oh, that's... No, no, I don't know what that is. Come on, man. There's a half-demolished apartment building. Looks like housing projects. Sounds like you're in the wards. Good. Brewer, anything else? Just a lot of buildings, Ray. Do they say anything? Well, I can't see. <laughs> Wait, more road cones. ran into him recently said he was homeless doped up on something that barely coherent
Kruger probably still Get blames me, me for all his problems. Ray, you'd really zap me, says the lunatic with the tire iron. I'm not a lunatic. So you're going to tell me what you did to piss off the fixers? Me? <laughs> this is on you. I'm still running from your mess. I have been ever since you and Rose decided to blow whistles at Bloom. I had a good life, Ray. You sure fooled me. We had to walk around on eggshells because you were such a head case. <laughs> well, Rose is dead now. And your little tantrum in 2003. How many people died? Yeah. <laughs> and I'm the head case. <laughs> You little shit. I'm sorry, I didn't... I, I... You know what? Thanks for the rescue. But I need to go. Eleven. Eleven people died. Lindsay Garcia. Jeremy Connors. You want more? because I can list them all for you. If you run, Bloom will find you. I know, because I'm the one who wrote the goddamn code that'll help him to do it. Now, I can get you out. But I need to hit Bloom again. Find out what the hell they know. You can stay in my place. Just don't touch my stuff, don't monkey with my system, and don't make any noise. Yeah. I'll try to control myself. And most importantly, do not touch any of my beer. I don't drink. Of course you don't. I wasn't planning on sticking around. I need to make a call. Detective Billing speaking. Sheila. Mystery man, is that you? I assumed you were dead. Did you miss me? Nope. I love the growing tower of crime reports on my desk. Please tell me that's why you called. Mm-hmm. Well, I'm running low on cash. 
and supplies. Well, there's plenty to do. Every gangbanger, goon, and gorilla's out there fighting for a piece of the cake now that Lucky Quinn and Iraq are dead. And I'm running out of people to trust within the department. Just pull me in the right direction and I'll do the dirty work. Or a fee. Taxpayer money, keeping the thugs off the streets. Ain't it beautiful when the system works, sweetheart? <laughs> you are bad. Hold on, I'll send you what I've got. Let me check my map. I've marked one of the groups for you. The Chicago South Club. Now spearheaded by Quinn's baby boy. All right. Some of these will be one-time targets of opportunity, and some of them will be done to send a message. Hit those once a day, so they know we're watching. Just remember, if you get caught... Never heard of you. Good. Give me a call before you go in. Sheila, I'm out to spawn. I'm about to head in. All right, watch yourself in there. These guys are connected. If they weren't, you know I'd have them behind bars already. Somebody's keeping my hands tied, which means they've got friends in high places. Which means... They got the best gear money can buy. I'm counting on that. Don't get too cocky. Seriously? I'm sending you all the information I've collected on them so you know just what you're getting into. Thank you, Detective. Over the phone. That noise. Ah oh, man, 
Jesus, what the fuck's going on? Huh? Go! Don't come back until you got him! Whoa! Get in there and find that bastard! We're done. Sheila, I got her done. Haven't lost your touch, mystery man. I've sent your payment, and like I've said... There's still plenty to do with your game. I'll let you know. Tobias always did know how to get my goat, but he's stuck with me, so he's gonna have to deal. If there's a chance I can get him out of this, I owe it to him to try. I'm giving up a hell of a lot to do it, too. Like, for all I know, he's probably already split on me. Shit. Ray, this place is amazing. I, I can't believe you live here. Lived. I'm past my checkout time. So we need to figure out what Bloom offered for your contract and who they paid. I need a way back into Bloom's system, but our date last night ended messy. So I'm hoping to find a CTOS access point that's a little less armed. Your old think tank. Is it still there? Bloom Forge? Yep, still there. Sometimes I raid their garbage for spare parts. Don't underestimate that place. It may have started as a hacker space, but Bloom poured in money. Do not underestimate these guys. Expect engineering gone wild. Mad science on a corporate budget. Yeah, I think I can handle a few nerds with expensive toys. I'm bringing Eugene. Thank <whistles> you. 
Here, boy. You have a dog? I'm allergic to dogs. He's not a dog. Well, I'm allergic to cats, too. I'm all set for Bloomforge. If the doorbell rings, don't answer it. I don't think these guys use doorbells anyway. someone Somebody be completely anonymous and a public figure. I wonder what he's hiding under that mask. The Chicago South Club only recently buried their criminal patriarch, Dermot Quinn. But his son, Neil Quinn, was questioned by the CPD this week for his suspected involvement in a series of fire bombings throughout Mad Mile. We're told that although no charges have been made, police will continue to put pressure on the club to prevent another Lucky. The way Aiden described him, I don't think there will ever be another Lucky. Still. There's an infinite supply of assholes ready to step into his old penny loafers.
I need to get in and out before they realize I've changed my M.O. Slacking on security here. Something set up here. Let's see if I can spoil the surprise. Looking at lasers here. What kind? Lasers. How many kinds are there? Well, in the gas laser family alone, you've got eight types: uh, nitrogen, carbon dioxide, argon. Damn it! Security lasers. Oh, oh, those are mine. What? Well, can you bypass it? 
Well, no, I mean, I ordered them before I got promoted out of Bloom Forge. I can't believe they kept them. The guys always did love retro tech, but you trip one of those and Bloom Forge goes offline to prevent a breach. Shit. through for me. Eugene? You're up. Eugene's wired up to my phone, so anything I can do from here, I should be able to do the same through his camera. Bet these eggheads never saw this coming. So Bloom's been looking at investing into our hacker space, and that's got everybody at each other's throats. Some of us want to avoid the corporate control, kind of goes against the Work, Eugene. Time to come on home. They say they want to invest, not dictate. Do I trust them? Looks like I'm gonna have to do some rerouting to shut these down. Lord. Yes, but I'm in the minority here. These guys would rather discuss Starship engineering than our future here. I'm gonna have to convince them. Also, why do people fixate on the aesthetics of a Starship? There's no need to be sleek in space. Functionality is key, not... They moved Rose and I into a proper blue lab this week, and... This place feels very... You, Frewer. Thanks. I... I think. What were you working on before Blue? M modular valve control systems built to expand or retract based on internal pressure changes. Oh, and the lasers. Yeah. Definitely you. Mm. Looks like I'll have to hack my way through here.
Are you fucking kidding me? I gotta call Frewer. Yeah. Are you fucking kidding me? I, uh... What? What indeed? What indeed? Forge guys run LSD late night laser parties here. See what you got on Frewer. Damn. That's worse than I thought. I'll call him once I'm out of here, but first, let's make sure I do get out of here. Time for me to make my exit. I'm gonna cut the lights. Better. This is good. Search the area. Do you see him? No. I don't see shit. You think he's gone? Quiet. Just keep looking. They can't shoot what they can't see. Have a look around and 
Watch your back. Ah! Oh! Ah! Jesus, where'd that come from? Ooh. Knock on, start looking. <laughs> 